the presentation taking place behind me for the first of the eight rounds of the FEI Nations Cup. The victorious team on the podium, Team Belgium, split not by jumping penalties, just by three seconds between them and the Netherlands. It went to a jump off. We had no jump offs last year in 2011 in the FEI Nations Cup, but that's how close it's been. The highest ranked Belgian rider in the Rolex rankings, Gregory, Gregory Watelet, chosen to come out and battle it out here in this wonderful arena, albeit somewhat colder than it was at the beginning of this competition. Gregory Watelet, Euphony Kajanin Z. Zanka Zyder bread, double clear. What does he do? Does he go for the clear? Or does he chase the clock? Four faults in a time of 44.16 to beat the time and score of Albert Vaughan for the Netherlands. Oh, well, if the noise is to go by, that would be on the floor, but it stayed. U-turn, complete U-turn, back to the last two parts, and that's down. Now he's got to, now he's got to put the skates on, 44.16. It's going to be close, but he's just got there. 41.714 for Team Belgium. Gregory Watelet comes home victorious. Yeah, he was looking fantastic. And I had to go against, again straight for the jump off. Uh, and it was for sure not so easy and she was tired. But uh, in the end, we, we won the nation comes here and it's super. Superb performance from Belgium, equally good performance, just three seconds, as I say, with, with Holland. And in third place, back in the top league, you have to mention Sweden. Great performance with all four of their riders jumping clear in round two. So a great way to start the FEI Nations Cup Series here in Laboule. It's been a great weekend. Join us in Rome in two weeks' time.